this divine being. Would you like to introduce yourself? Hi, my name is Magdalene, and I live here in Port Townsend, located on the Olympic Peninsula. And I believe we're going to talk about community. Yes, we are. What does community mean to you, Magdalene? <laughs> So I have actually just been having this conversation today multiple times with people about what does community mean and is community just a buzzword or does it actually really exist? And one of the things that I do as part of my work with the Production Alliance, our mission is to build community through celebration. So I think about community a lot. And for me, um, one of the ways I think about community is we live in a special place here in Port Townsend and often people come here and they experience something different. They're like, this feels different. It feels like a, there's something here. There's like something. And they often move here. And so I'm a big a believer in the power of invitation because many of us don't know how to interact with community or culture without just consuming. Consuming is how we've been taught to do that. And you'll deplete the community if you do that. And so what I believe in is the power of invitation to invite people in and learn other ways to participate with community and culture other than just consuming it and learning how to participate. And, you know, I think I was just chatting with a young woman that I know about what, how did she, has she believed community when all the way through college was a buzzword. She didn't think it actually existed. And for her, the answer was, do I have friends that are outside of my age? Do I have friends that are outside of my work? Do I have intergenerational friends? You know, how am I, am I going to be doing something that where I'm not just thinking about what am I personally going to get out of it, but for the common good. And so that's really what we're thinking about is how can we uplift everyone? I knew I asked the right person. Blessed be Magdalene. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, let's see, your name isn't Paige. Thank you. Your name is Reed. That's correct. Hi, Reed. So, hello. So what community means to me is people helping people. It's as simple as that. That is what community is. Community is a really short answer for me. It's just a sense of belonging and a sense of home. Truly. Yeah. Yeah. Being with your sweet. homies, feeling safe, respected. Yes. Yes. Safe to speak up and be you. Oh, and definitely. All of that. Self-expression. Hang out. Yeah. Perfect. Simple answer. Yes. Thank you. How long of an answer here? Oh, about a minute and a half. Minute. So when I say community, all right, three minutes. Three minutes. When I say community, what comes up for you? Uh, when I think of community, I think of, uh, like, neighborhoods within a city all coming together, um, you know, in like a in like a setting where they wouldn't normally all meet and then you know you get to meet your neighbors get to meet different um you know races of different people that live in the neighborhood um getting to know each other and you know i i think a lot of the times um community also involves food um because i do i love food and i oh, love look and you're handing out these drinks today going out with some drinks day. to go with some yeah. food yeah and i because i think food really bring, brings a lot of people together yeah. so i think of community events that involve like cookouts uh. or um yeah stuff i like asked that. the right person <laughs> hey what's your first name adam thank you adam of great course. answer started uh, uh, the, the, this fine group of women in initiative to pull resources. How would, when I say community, what does that bring up for you? So community to me means everybody working together for the common cause and the common good. Uh, I have been blessed with being in Port Townsend for almost five years at this point and I've felt like it's been really easy and the community has been so open to me joining in all the fun and working towards various goals to better ourselves. So this is Quimper Events Collective I'm representing today. We are a collective of event professionals in the area. Uh, everything from venues, I work at the Northwest Maritime Center so I'm representing a venue. Uh, we've got florists, we've got photographers, we've got officiants. Everything under the sun you need to plan any sort of event. The community is just making sure that everyone has access to as much of the... Um, that they're able to go out and experience nature and be able to uh, travel and be able to see the world as it is. I love that. Yeah. It's a, it is what I'm about and I'd like to have it happen. So he engineered this um, camper van. There's a lot of people. 
with houses on the road now and that fits the store model of having a cement pad for amazing people on the road and uh, to spread the word that we're going to have a place for people to come and land for food and uh, great brotherhood and sisters in all different forms and they have an urban sketching group cole one more question tell me about that um so locally we have a um well urban sketchers is a global um, community, but we have one local here in Port Towns in the Port Towns and Urban Sketchers. And every uh, so here, here are two uh, <laughs> gypsies, and this one has a vintage trailer. And this one, her is Sir La Mer, De La Mer, De La Mer, Nicole oh De La Mer. God. And she, uh, we're, oh. we're gypsies <laughs> looking for a better world, That's and right, we all right. met, but I feel like. We're soul sisters. <laughs> and over here, this beautiful being, she's a pet groomer, and she's seen the van on Facebook. Yes. And so she's here looking at the van. She's looking for me. I mean, they, are we finding the tribe or what? I know. Yeah. And yesterday I needed chocolate, and this divine being said, come to my booth. Oh, yeah. Delicious chocolate. <laughs>